All right, what's up everyone? Brad Chimlewski here. We're in a game uh, on the EU servers. We're playing Reza. Uh, been trying to make Reza work. He's been uh, kind of coming up in the Bangalore 8 a little bit. And I, I just want to see him shine. I think his kit is pretty useful. It's pretty neat. When we were just playing on the EU server, I wanted to make sure my skill tier doesn't decay. And yeah, Rezo seemed like a good pick here. So on our side we have uh, Arden, uh, Rona in lane, and then the Rezo in jungle. And then they have a Saw in lane, a Kashka, and a Lance. So they were able to pick up that Ancient Treant. I didn't want to mess with Kashka in level 1. She just has a very good level 1 fight. And with Lance there, if we were to get in trouble, we'd have some issues. So um, I'm worried for Rona here in lane up against Saw. That's a huge challenge for her, um, especially if she basically gets two people up there all game. Arden should probably go up in lane and help uh, Rona out just because she is going to have an issue. Uh, but she seems to be doing a pretty good job farming. Uh, Saw only has three minions right now at minute and a half and she has nine so being very careful. Uh, kind of come up to see if we can make any sort of play here up in lane. Uh, and so Rona gets rooted and then she still dives in but I'm gonna go try to chase Saw down and I pick up the first kill um, and not too bad. So Rona survives. She gets pushed back, but Kashka was down here. She took my farm over here, and she took that ancient treant. So that's a little bit of a bummer. She's starting to, you know, get those levels up a little quicker than me. I did get the kill, so can't complain there. All right, so now Arden's just uh, trying to keep the lane in check there, fighting Lance. Rona is back. Still ahead in farm. Plus she has the assist now, so she's doing a little better in items. And here I am just clearing the jungle. I think I ended up going back after this one. Uh, maybe not. Maybe I decided to go see if I could grab this farm so Kashka didn't steal it all. And I get there just as she's uh, running away with it. I think she's going to wait for the ancient treant. And I'm gonna go ahead and try to rotate up in lane, see if we can pick up another kill on Saw. Fortunately, he gets away this time. Gosh, gets that tree, and that's so much experience for her. Uh, and I kind of should have contested that. Um, I underestimated the experience she was gonna get out of that. Cause she's level five now, and I'm only level three. That ultimate's gonna be up very, very soon. Um, I go back, I pick up pieces for the banner. And Kashka still hasn't gone and shot at all. So if this continues, if I run into her again in the jungle, I should be able to fight her and hopefully win just because I should have a little more damage than her. Uh, and then Rona was able to somehow pick up a kill uh, and saw here in lane. Here's Kashka again, stealing my farm. Uh, and I decide, you know what? I gotta go, I gotta go look for her. She finds me right here in the jungle. She's still a level ahead of me. She just hit six, put a point in her ultimate. She throws it down, but I was able to pick up the kill with Arden's help. I don't know if I would have won without Arden. Uh, hard to say, but we won, we picked up the kill there. And now we end up taking a bit of her jungle, so payback. Then uh, Rona had to go home. So she's coming back to lane. She's still ahead in farm a little bit. Uh, not too bad. But Thaw isn't pressuring the lane as well as he, he should have been hitting the turret the whole time. Yeah. Uh, so I'm just hoping I can pick up my uh, shop minions here without Kashka stealing them. Rona gets another kill on the Saw. With looks like uh, Arden's help. Kashka's up in lane. She doesn't have an ultimate because that's still down. I'm still a little bit of ways from uh, hitting six up for myself, but Rona is just doing work in lane to this Lance. She doesn't even care about the stuns. 
Got the Servant's Mask, so she's healing up very quickly. Um, and then Saw, looks like he grabbed like a mixed bag of stuff. And Kashka snuck up from behind. So, he was able to sneak on to uh, Rona a little bit. Now, I'm six now. Kashka, I assume, was still hanging around here, so I was playing a pretty cautious. I'm uh, just trying to get some more damage on the saw and uh, lands here. But yeah, I end up just dipping down back to the jungle. I'd love to finish this Stormcrown banner. So I grab that, grab some farm. Um, clear in the jungle really fast. Akashi's got an aftershock, so her damage is uh, a little scary right now. But she comes at me again with the ultimate first. Um, I probably should have ran towards Arden, but I decided to run to the Crystal Sentry. Arden's there, I'm able to alt, and we take down Kashka. So, uh, Kashka got a little greedy there, and we were able to take the kill. She led off with her alt, which was kind of a huge mistake. Alright, so now we're back up in lane. Uh, we can't really make a play here at the moment. They're gonna back, and they're just too far away. Uh, Lance just picks up his fountain. Arden's had his for a while. I'm just gonna look for some scout traps, see if some farm's up. I see my team rotating over this way. So we rotate together and we find Kashka. We're more worried about taking on this crystal sentry. Thought should be pushing lane harder, but he wasn't able to really do much. We steal some farm and then we're gonna try to rotate up behind them which is a very uh, awkward spot for us. Uh, Rona gets alted by Kashka, and we're just in a really bad choke point right here. Uh, Kashka pops her healing flask, gets away, and they're just gonna chase me. I'm, I'm just like, I have to lead them away as much as possible. They split me up here. Uh, Arden comes in to help me, and we're able to pick up this kill on to Kashka, which was really great. And then I walked into the Serpent's uh, Suppressing Fire, and that just, that sucked. Uh, but Arden gets away, so we don't lose too much there. We got one kill, they got two kills, so. Uh, that was just a really bad spot for us to fight. We shouldn't have fought there. Um, suppressing Fire, Kashka groups up. Lance can knock us against the wall. It was just all around bad. So, here we go. Just continue to clear the jungle. We are a little bit behind in farm with Kashka, but we have uh, four kills. She only has one. And it seems like Saw is just playing a little too scared, which is never good. Here's Kashka again, attempting to try to invade and find me. A uh, great ultimate by Arden, we get the gauntlet down, and then I think I can kill Lance. I don't know why I thought I could do this. I get stunned, Crystal Sentry's kicking my butt. I alt here to maybe save myself, but I should have alted farther away. Lance, kicking me down. Damn, Rona with the jump away, missing. Getting out of almost every impale, so nice job to her. We got 82 farmed to 62, so she's just doing great up there. All right, Kashka just clearing out her jungle. She's building that broken myth next, and she doesn't have much defense against Rona. So if Rona jumps on her, uh, it'll be trouble. And then we just kind of clear our jungle. And we're probably looking for a fight here. I'm close, I'm getting closer to my Aftershock. I'm getting a little more damage. So I've grabbed that Aftershock. I've grabbed the Aftershock, the Storm Crown. So if we get in a fight here, we should be able to do some work. Rona has the Breaking Point and the Serpent's Mask. Um, so she's uh, pretty tanky and should start out putting some good damage. Uh, we catch Saw rotating to the shop here. We're able to keep him. I think we kept him from buying there. 
But Rona gets in a bit of trouble there. She gets ulted by Kashka, so that ultimate is down. Uh, we all loop around from the other side of the jungle, but just an awkward situation here. They were all too far away. Rona was low. So just, uh, just trouble. Um, hopefully Rona can heal back up with the Serpent's Mask. Maybe make a play here. Without Kashka here, kind of rotating funny. This is the same spot we fought last time that was really bad for us. So we need to get out of here. Uh, Arden's going to go down. He just got caught out. Once again, same spot. Really awkward fight for us. And, you know, Roan is going to have a hard time defending this turret. She gets ulted there. She does pick up a kill onto Lance, but we lose the turret. I couldn't have stuck around because I would have died too. We were both low. So I just go ahead and, like, grab some of the jungle. And I will grab minions while I'm up here. And then Arden just hangs out in base. For a long time here. I don't know, maybe he disconnected there. That's why he looked like he was stuck in that fight. But yeah, so he just hangs out in lane for a long time. And then uh, we see them doing the gold miner because we have a scout trap right there. Um, Rona and I are running there. She gets the amazing steal on that. And we're able to pick up the, the payout. That was close. Really nicely done by her. So Arden's back now. I don't know. He might have just been waiting for the echo, but not really. Not really sure what he was doing. But he could have been having issues because it looks like this could be a SEA account. So maybe playing from far away and having some ping. And then we're just waiting to try to bait Saw out here, but he really runs away. Um, and if Arden might have been there in that fight, we might have been able to pick up both kills. And it might have been really nice for us. But unfortunately, we just kind of back off. We're waiting for uh, Arden to kind of get back in here with the fight with us. But he seems like he's having uh, some connection issues. Um, he kind of just dips back here and hangs up by the turret for a while. Rona and I, we're both shopping. So we need to rotate up now to protect this turret. Arden is there, but I think they see him and he's having issues. I'm able to get the Atlas down onto Saw. We're getting out quite a bit of damage. We pick up two kills, but we're unable to grab that kill onto um, Ashka here. Just couldn't keep up with her. Um, my dashes weren't up, and she's just way too slippery, way too fast. But we're able to tank up this turret. And get it down. Arden probably shouldn't have gone home here. Should have stuck around. We could have uh, maybe taken a crystal sentry. We could have done a little more work. But he decided to go home. I don't know if he's waiting for money again. He's already got that echo. But yeah. So he's just he's at home. So we we kind of need to play safe. Wait for him to come back. So we just clear out the jungle. And they're going to start to push lane a little bit. So he wasn't waiting for an item because he still has a lot of money. I see Kashka doing this. I get in. I steal that farm. But then I just get stuck here in the corner. That was a really good get the end wall by Arden. And it was unfortunate. Like I did get the farm. But it really backfired, and then my team, uh, I, I put him in a huge bit of trouble here. Uh, Rona's trying to do what she can, but Saw's just on the side, just knocking her down. So that was totally my fault. I should have let her have the farm. Yep. And then, for some reason, there's 10 seconds left. Saw goes to do this gold miner. Lance does not help. He wanted to push lane, which I think Lance made the better call. 
And Saw is not able to get that. I kind of rushed in there to maybe try to delay it in case it was close, but he didn't get the payout. Kraken's up. I do have to back because I was low. Um, if Kashka would have been there, they might have been able to start this Kraken and get it down before we showed up, but uh, Arden and Rona go in check. Not happening. Saw infuses, so we need to be a little careful now. Um, I'm working towards a Eve right now, and then I'll finish that off with a Broken Myth. That'll kind of be my build. Uh, looks like Kashka is building some more damage too. And not sure what she wanted with this Oak Heart. If she wanted a uh, War Treads or was just trying to get a little more defense in her kit. Maybe another Fountain. Maybe a Fountain. Forget at this point. But then they check. And this is the same spot where we had some issues on the other side, but we're able to come out really well ahead here. We get the double gauntlets down. That was a really nice get the wall by Lance, but we're able to pick up the ace. And the Kraken is up. So Ace, Kraken, where we were having issues fighting over here, we did somehow pick up the win here. And that wasn't too bad. Just dead bodies all around. Uh, Rona goes and pushes lane. Pretty good call. We have a Storm Crown. And we have quite a bit of damage, so it doesn't take us too long to pick this up. And we get the turret, so that's a good amount of gold for us. I believe I was short just a little bit on the eve. But I, I grab an infusion, and I'm build up the energy battery, just kind of working towards that eve now. I think it's 850 from what I have right now. For some reason, we take this Crystal Sentry instead of all pushing with the Kraken. So they're able to get the Kraken down to about half health before we're even there to fight. Kind of a huge bummer. Rona gets ulted. Um, and we're just trying to get this other choke point turret down. They are so low. We just couldn't we couldn't get in there, and I was just on the back line too far. So I have to run away. I should have been closer in those fights. Probably could have picked up the kill onto Lance and Koshka, and then Rona and I could have taken down Thaw, oh, and then we probably could have finished right there. But fortunately doesn't happen they're able to defend we did get the choke point turret uh that was a this is a huge opportunity for them now they picked up um kills on two people kraken the net outcome of that was way better for them than us although we did get the turret before the kraken was taken um just they could have seized on this opportunity uh, really well the gold is so close uh, we're just 2,000 gold apart, so that's really not nothing. Um, if, if anything, Lance building so much damage is hurting them just a bit. So here we go. Kashka's getting aggressive on me again. I alt, but I don't really hit anyone, and I have to back away. And I'm not in range for that fountain use. Uh, so I back away. I'm fearful. And then Rona... Comes up big, triple kill, ace, and that's it. I should have stuck around in that fight, stayed a little closer to try to get that fountain. Uh, but I'm just going to run now, hopefully join the team for the victory photo here at, <laughs> at the Vein Crystal. Uh, but before I even get there, they're able to take down one turret without even any minions. They tank that up like a boss. I'm here to help take down the other turret. And their team is just spawning now. We have the damage. We just have too much going on. And we're able to pick up the win right there. So my last item would have been the Broken Myth. Uh, if I would have died, no. I was, I was so out of that fight, but they tried to push on me so hard there for the kill that Rona picked up there at the end. So nice job by everyone, especially this lane Rona going up against the Saw. That is a tricky, tricky thing to do. Here's all the builds. 
And yeah, Rona even having more farm than Saw. Like, that's just well played, Rona. Yeah. Just the. Uh, yeah. Well played. Well, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hit that subscribe button. New videos going up all the time on the channel. And I'll be back soon with another one. Take care. Shatter the Vein.